Hi folks, Ryan Kilpatrick here with American RV, here to show you the Passport 2890. As you look at the front here, you'll see a docking light, so when you back your truck up at nighttime, you'll be able to see all the connections. Um, you have the diamond plating, so anything thrown up by your tow vehicle, it's not going to nick up the front of your trailer. Coming down the side, pass-through storage. It's actually lit, and you can look inside here, you can actually see the aluminum framing of the Passport, which makes it really lightweight trailer. You have your stabilizer jacks front and back to take away any rocking in the trailer. Um, a rain gutter system, so all the rain from the roof will come off and it's not going to run down the sidewalls and create any streaking. An electric awning, runs almost the whole length of the trailer, really nice feature. Double door entry. Passport does the spread axles, they're actually about 10 inches wider than uh, the competition. It allows for easy towing and it reduces the sway. You also have outside speakers. Um, which you can adjust from the inside on the stereo to play them inside or out, whichever you prefer. Easy entry access handle. You have three step access, really easy to get into. As you come around the back here, you'll notice the 2890 has a huge back window, full size spare tire. And you're also going to have a five inch crown roof. It's going to run all the water away, and you're not going to get any water sitting on top. On the Grand Touring Edition for the Passport, you get a 36 inch slide out, just the touch of a button. Um, let's take a look on the inside of the 2890. Right as you enter in, you're going to notice you got two nice chairs with kind of a coffee table in the middle. Nice to enjoy the big back window. Come in, you'll notice the big slide room gives you lots of space. Um, the couch is going to be a jackknife sofa. Just pull and drop, very easy. Also the table, the U-shaped dinette, you'll be able to see a lot of people. This is also going to drop down in. You'll be able to create a nice sized bed here as well. Um, in the kitchen, you'll have the two compartment sink with the cutting board inserts, high angle sink, faucet, microwave, three burner stove top with high output in the front and an oven, gas and electric refrigerator, and you also have some storage back here. Lots of storage space in the passports. These shelves will actually lift out of the way too if you want to put in clothing, um, depending on what you need more of. We have 26 inch flat screen LCD TV. This is your MP3 DVD CD player. Runs everything inside and it runs the speakers on the outside. Lots of storage here as well. As you come back into the bedroom area, you'll also notice that there's tons of storage here down the hallway. And then as you enter into the bathroom area here, you got a neo angle sh sink with glass shower, foot flush toilet, and a skylight in the shower as well. And then in the bedroom, you're going to have storage underneath the bed, and then his and her closet space and space above. Um, on the passport, all your controls are central, so you're going to have the buttons here for your slide out, um, your black tank, gray tank, and fresh water readouts let you know how full they are. Water heater, ignition, gas or electric, and one touch for your awning. Um, I want to thank you for visiting the 2890 with me. Visit us at AmericanRV.com.